Oh my god, hello. This is freaking insane. Hey, what's up guys? My name is Brandon Gozerar and today we are at my house uh, in the morning. And we're preparing for Hurricane Irma. I figured why not go ahead and show you a little glimpse into my normal life and kind of show you what we do for Hurricane Irma. If nothing cool happens, this won't even be on my channel. Let's hope for something cool to happen. You ready for the storm, Shy? Shy? You ready for the storm, baby? Hmm? We're gonna get a little storm. So the garbage men took our neighbor's trash, but they never took ours. Look at Shy. Hi, Shy. Oh, you're a good girl. All right, guys, so we just went and did some last minute running around. I'm sorry if it's uh, windy. I mean, it's a hurricane. Um, but we did some last minute running around and people are scrambling like ants. Like it is, it's crazy. We got all the water we need, we got all the food we need. My grandfather's staying here. We're actually just about to run and grab some last minute stuff from his mobile home. So I'll vlog that. We have dog food, we have cat litter, cat food. Rosie, my hedgehog has food. His bird has food, we have food. I'm updating you guys currently on Twitter, so you guys have probably already seen all those updates. We've got portable chargers. I have two batteries left to that are completely charged so that I can continue to vlog. I have an extra memory card. Right now I'm telling you guys all this, but I'm also kind of going over it in my head to make sure that I have everything that I need. Hi, pretty bird. Look how beautiful this bird is. Look at him. So king, a little guy. So my cat actually uh, got in here and wanted to play with the birdie. And the entire cage fell. And now there's bird seed everywhere. It's my grandfather's bird, by the way. So we're not going to tell him that uh, the cage got dumped, okay? Okay. Important. Take that because this is who he used to work for. So at the moment, we're here at my grandfather's house, kind of just uh, taking everything because we don't really know what's going to be left when we come back after the hurricane. It's my first ever picture taken when I was adopted by my family. And I've always been a little Disney fan. This is the rocking chair that I used to sit with my grandma in. And this is the TV that I grew up watching all those Disney movies on. It's my mother's wedding dress. Can you still fit in it? Yeah, no. <laughs> no. I don't want to open it because once you open it, the air gets to it. And then it'll get all ruined. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> how pretty I was. How thin I was. Those back sleeves there. though. I there, know. We didn't, goofy. We didn't want to take it out and let air get to it, but that's what it looked like. We found jugs that we can fill water up with. Hi, Grandpa. <laughs> Thank you. Sabrina's getting a kick out of these little pictures. Do you get braces? Yes. Santa. That gap, though. That gap dough. <laughs> These are some of the uh, old VHS tapes that I used to watch when I was a kid. When it comes to your oxygen and the need for it, that you're afraid you wouldn't be able to get home. Oh, the lack of power was my problem. And I think that was the lack of power. That's about 100%.
Just got stung by a wasp. That's what I needed. So I just got a phone call from work and they need me to come in during the hurricane. I work in a hospital and I deliver food to patients. So I'm not gonna be able to be here for my family or Sabrina through this. I just kinda wanna cry. But, but, look on the bright side. I wanted so bad to be able to help the victims in Hurricane Harvey. I really, really, really wanted to get over there and just rescue people and help them and help in the shelters and when I'm not delivering food for those four hours, maybe this is my chance. And if I get to help people and they allow me to help people, whether it's comforting people, whether it's bringing them food, making sure that they're okay, I just, I don't care about delivering food on my hours that I work. What's gonna matter the most to me is since I can't be here for Sabrina and my family, What's gonna matter the most is that I'm able to help these people that have had to leave their homes behind and had to evacuate and don't really have anything with them. All these families, all these children, all these elderly people just... That's gonna be the reason for it all. I don't wanna go. I really don't wanna go. I don't want to leave my family, I don't want to leave Sabrina, I don't want to leave the people closest to me that need me, but since I have to go, and I'm being forced to go by my work, I'm just really, really, really happy that I can still help people in some way, shape, or form. And I'm, in a way, I'm looking forward to helping these victims of Hurricane Irma. No, I, I'm not in a way. I actually am looking forward to helping these victims. I just wish that I didn't have to leave my family to do so in their time of need. And to everybody who's affected right now and who has been affected because this video is probably going to come out once everything's over and done with, to the people who have been affected, or and currently, while this is being filmed, are being affected. All my thoughts and my prayers and just... My heart is with you guys. And I really hope that if any of you guys who watch my videos and are part of our uh, little family that we got here on YouTube, I hope none of you are affected. And if, and if you are, I hope you just stay safe. And if you guys ever need anything, I'm here and I'll help you as much as I possibly can. I love you guys. Sabrina's making tacos tonight, and it's my job to make sure that it doesn't burn uh, while she goes and gets some supplies. While we still have electric. It's just started sprinkling a little bit, guys. So I thought that I'd come out, show a little before, and after of what this place looks like. Here it comes. We're watching the news and playing board games and drinking. Well, alright guys, it's late, it's time for bed. We just got the news that Hurricane Irma is heading straight for Tampa and that's where I live. Hey guys, so it is, um, 2.44 a.m. right now. And I can't sleep just because I'm kind of like shooken up. I've been sitting right here on the bathtub just kind of looking at uh, live streams of the hurricane. And we put the bird in here away from any like windows or just anything that could like really hurt it but we also put it in here because my cat's been kind of like she usually sleeps with us so we wanted to bring her in because we didn't want her to like freak out or anything but as i've been sitting here i've been hearing like the gutters during rain and a lot of wind i'm being quiet right now because sabrina i think is sound asleep 
on owl. <laughs> You guys hear that? Good morning, guys. Uh, the hurricane's here. Oh my god, look. It's just like flying. The rain is just like flying out of the gutters. So the rain's finally here, and we're hunkering down. It's gonna be intense. Welcome to Florida. How are you doing? Fine. Scared? No. I'll protect you, babe. So we're really bored just sitting in the house and my dad's currently... I'll just show you what's going on. The two freaks in Hurricane Irma. <laughs> I'm gonna pee my pants! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Where are you? I can't find you! <laughs> She's probably looking out her window like... <laughs> I see you too! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, I got a stick in my shoe. Oh my god. You're gonna fall and get hurt, and I'm gonna have to call 911. <laughs> I'm gonna pee. You shall not pass. Oh, dang it. Oh, your stick broke. <laughs> I'm protecting you. Do you feel protected? No. Good. Get down here immediately! Quick, keep on! Everybody run! I'll be right back. Where are you going? McDonald's. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Are you excited? I want the power to go out. <laughs> then I can't edit. Irma was very angry. She was dumped by her boyfriend, Harvey, who had booty with Katia. Irma's secret Mexican lover, Jose, pursued her too, but doesn't have an illegal permit to follow her all the way to the USA. Now Irma's out of breath, and it's the end of Irma once we saw her love her drive. Oh my God, that is too funny. You're really pretty. <laughs> oh my God. He just pushed me. No. Aww, he made me ink. Aww, you made me ink. <laughs> That's 
to me. <laughs> she just made the wind happen. Oh my. You see that tree back there? Oh my god, you are though. What? When she does that, the wind picks up. <laughs> Watch. <laughs> Thumbnail. Thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody had too much soda. <laughs> the spirits are angry. <laughs> if you can make it go, can you make it stop? No, I can't do that. I don't know how. You're the wind goddess. <laughs> Babe, I think you did it a little too rough. Why does it keep coming out when I'm talking to somebody? Why is that rough? The rain dance. Well, okay, but do the reverse rain dance. I don't know. It's the coming. It's the coming. <laughs> We can't! So we're getting cabin flavor! Big one. You just broke your glasses. <laughs> you just dab? Yeah. <laughs> Hurricane Irma's coming, and I say, go away! Yeah, yeah. 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 That was boring in here. I've been cooking for three freaking days for this crew. I'm done. It's only been happening for two. I got you Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Can you count? Uno, dos, tres. What happened Uno Friday? For me. Friday, I cooked for me, son. your girlfriend and grandpa. You didn't cook for me. You were working. Today, I cooked breakfast for your father or grandfather. And then I cooked dinner for everybody. I made two breads, I made a cake, controlled the dogs, so they were all happy. It's completely zoomed in on you. Me? Yeah. Or her. No, you. Oh, don't, because my hair's a mess. Oh. Let me tell you a story. Harvey chased Irma. No, Harvey chased, what was it? <laughs> Harvey? Irma <laughs> chased it? Harvey. What? Irma chased Harvey. Harvey lost interest, so she had an affair with Katya, and now she's going after Jose, but he can't get any closer because he doesn't have a permit to come to the U.S., so Irma's done. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Hi, Brighton. Kitty. Are you scared? Brighton, take this. <laughs> My pleasure. Not towards me, please. Thank you. This is me.
Yeah. No. 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 I knew it was me all along. I'm getting very good. That was my guess. I was going to the, I was getting out of the hall. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know how, but he did. <laughs> so we didn't pause the TV and the lights are beginning to flicker. So now we need to make sure that we can get as much charge on our cell phones as possible. What's wrong, Brighton? What's wrong, Bailey? What's wrong, Brighton? So you guys can see the TV started playing again. You gonna play games? <laughs> Brighton. No. Oh, wait, let me look again just to make sure. Mm. Oh. oh my god. <sighs> uh -oh. Mm -hmm. Ouch. Now we have to wait and see what she asked for the next time. Mr. Green. <laughs> Library green and a wrench? Yeah. No. Is that it? Is. Uh, is that it? Oh, what? This. Nice. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Not right. Who's got the wrench? Not me. Not me. Not me. I, I do. I don't have any weapons. I called it. You didn't show it to me. Oh, I. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I was thinking that it was the wrench. I'll say nice already. Wait, who had the hall then? Because I kept on saying hall. I never had the hall. I did. I had the billiard room in Mrs. Peacock. <laughs> Twice she did it. Twice. There's people posing as Tampa Electric going to houses trying to rob people in the midst of all this. Thank God we don't have Tampa Electric. Thank you, there's some in my fridge. Everything's breathing. I'm going to go outside with a floodlight. Let me just scan really quick. Okay, I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. What? It's just, you don't think it's raining, it doesn't look like it is, yeah. but then you walk out there and then it just like pelts oh, you in the face. Okay. Ooh, it's lightning. Hello. Okay. It's official. The hurricane's getting closer. This is insane. See, the thing is, with this, is we're gonna get the thick of the hurricane at like three in the morning, so a lot of it's just gonna be dark. People are uh, looting right near our house, so that's kind of scary. But I'm very happy that we didn't leave our house so that people didn't loot us. And you've got people breaking into people's homes. You won't have the ladies, but I'm sure Mr. Smith and Wesson will be glad to greet them. Oh, yeah. It's a make of a gun. One of the ladies put her tenant works for the power company and robbers are dressing up as power company employees and knocking on people's doors. Please do not enter your doors tonight. Also, there's been a little shift in the track and she is now coming across past her county and back out into the water. Oh, great. You can't believe everything on there. Yeah, I'll have to can't. We'll have to look. Those are all the people waiting in Georgia too. for us. Yeah. Now, earlier away. they showed him all of Epcot Center. She passed away. Epcot yeah, as in that's Disney? Where I yes. Seen yes. Him. yes. At Epcot. In Georgia. But in the part of Epcot Center, we're waiting all the. Because number one, Duke, Duke Energy is from the East Coast. Alright, guys, so while we were upstairs, my parents actually heard a transformer pop, which is a little box hanging on telephone lines, which gives us power. Power. Our power didn't go out, but somebody's power must have. So I don't know how long I'm gonna have light in here, but I'm definitely, definitely, get, definitely gonna try and keep everything going with a flashlight. It's getting close, guys. I'm seriously, all my thoughts right now are with everybody being affected. My heart goes out to you and your families. I love you guys. Let's pick up and have some more fun. So I got caught in the middle of shaping. Fun!
The power's out, by the way, just so you know. <sighs> fun, fun, fun. The whole power line came down. Yeah, I know. It was crazy, because we were sitting in the living room, and it, you hear this, like, pop, and we look out to where your mom and Lynn are sleeping, and you just see these bright lights. Oh, did they go to bed? No, we were playing oh, the game. Oh no, I saw that out there. We were playing blue the blue and orange and stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, I wish I was vlogging, but I was freaking shaping. We were playing the game. That was crazy. Yeah, like, and it then was we like saw blue lights. and orange lights. Yeah, and the dog started barking. All right, well, if I'm half shaven, I'm sorry. Of course I get caught while shaving. Yeah, guys, there was some like orange flickers, orange and blue flickers right outside here. And then the dog started barking and just, I thought that like there was a floodlight on or a, um, it was bright. Power lines fell down because trees just collapsed right on top of them. So we can't even go outside in the rain because it could completely just electrocute us. Now it's getting serious. Kitty, Kitty, where'd you go? Kitty, where'd you go? No, come on. Come on, you gotta, you gotta come with us. I know. I know, Kitty. Give me a second, guys. I'm gonna actually use you as a flashlight. Hold on. Okay. Is that the tape? Yeah, we're going through I can't see. I know you guys can't see me if I point it away, so that kind of sucks. Okay, great. So if I point it this way, you guys can still see me off of like the background. Rosie, my hedgehog, is having a freaking field day. Because she doesn't like cold. She doesn't like light. So there she is. Hi, Rosie. You doing okay? You doing okay, baby? Hi, baby. You doing all right? I know it's scary. You okay? So I put her right down here behind the chair. She's currently hiding behind her wheel right now because she doesn't like that she's been moved. But that's what needs to happen. Hi, baby. You doing okay? Doing okay, Kenny? Yeah, you're okay. You're okay. gonna go ahead and curl yeah. up with Cheyenne right now. So my dad's actually found uh, little birdies that are just huddled together under our roof. It's like the cutest thing. I'm gonna go show you guys. Look at the birdies. We're about to take the dogs out two by two and just let them go to the bathroom because one of them actually had an accident on the rug, which is not their fault. We had them in for a long time, we understand. And they were actually very scared because of the power arcing. <sighs> Things just got serious. We knew this was gonna happen. It's not a big deal at all, but it just sucked. But on the bright side, I got my Lucky Ducky socks. So that's cool. Lucky Ducky socks, rubber ducky, you're the one. You make bath time. So much fun. If anybody knows that reference, comment in the comments below. It's not Disney. I'll tell you that. Rubber ducky, you're the one. You make bath time so much fun. While we take the dogs out, I don't know how much I'm gonna actually be able to vlog just because I need to watch these dogs and I need to watch where the uh, power is and just make sure that they don't get electrocuted or anything. I got my boots on. Let's go. There's a trick with you. Right, let's go. I got it. Go. Oh my god, hello. Branch was just right in front of my way. I'm wet, I'm wet, I'm wet, I'm wet. Get in, get in, grab. He might want to come out here because for some reason. Uh, you might want to come out here, Dad. The inside of your car is soaked for some reason. Watch out for the limb. I know these are really nice boots, too, but I thought these were the best boots to wear. Really trying to vlog, but it's raining. 
We have a plan, now we just gotta execute it. Okay. We're taking the dogs out. Be careful of water. Guys, guys, come here, guys, guys, come here, come here, come here. Hi, shy. Guys, go potty. Go down, down. It's okay. It's just a rainstorm. Go potty. Go potty. Bailey. It's okay, guys. It's okay. Don't worry. You're okay. This is freaking insane. Good girl, Reba. Go potty, shy. The one that was scared is going potty. All right, everybody else. <laughs> no, he was actually crying for you. He wanted you here. Come on, it's okay. There's more arcing out here too. This is dangerous as hell. Finnegan, it's okay. It's okay, Finn. Come here, buddy. Come here. Finnegan, right here. Come here. Good boy, Finny. Good boy, Finny! Good boy! Who are you? Okay, you're both here. Alright, because there's arcing in the back over there. That was an event. You okay, babe? The trees have been uprooted. I'll show you guys in the morning, but it's crazy. Over that branch. Alright. Look at that towel that's in the chair. Here, spring. Here. You okay? Yeah. I'm so glad it went that way though. Thanks, that was. Oh, thanks. Thanks, that's just downright terrible. Absolutely. And you're taking advantage of people trying to leave their home and everything. There's been armed robbers. Oh, yeah, Tammy. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> Why does this stuff happen to good people? I'm not talking about the hurricane. I'm not talking about the winds. I'm not talking about the trees falling down. I'm not talking about the rain. I'm talking about the people that are getting held at gunpoint. Innocent people told that the power company is here to help them. I'm talking about those people. I'm only vlogging as a way to vent and keep it going. I'm not doing it for entertainment. I don't feel like I have to. I feel like I want to, and it's supposed to keep you safe. Actually, my favorite pajama pants. The robberies have gotten so bad that my dad, who doesn't believe in firearms, doesn't even like my airsoft gun, I cut the orange part off of this airsoft gun for uh, videos when I was doing special effects and he told me to keep this upstairs because it looks so real he just wants us to be safe we're gonna go to bed guys I'll see you in the morning that wasn't thunder?
morning, guys. I only got two hours of sleep. Because of everything that was going on. They made it through the hurricane. Hey, baby. I'll show you guys around. Good boy, Cooper. You guys did really good. That's not a pond. It's not a lake either. That's a horse pasture. It's okay, you were a good boy. They're all just lined up, waiting for us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Part of our sprinkler system right there, and the roots of the trees. So that's how big it is in comparison to my dad. My dad's about 5'10". Went to look out my back door this morning. Look what's there. It's a big old tree. Right on top of our fence. There used to be like a bunch of parrots that would just be in there. I don't know where they would come from, but it was really pretty and really cool. <laughs> completely uprooted so if you look right here the reason why it didn't fall on our fence is only because of these wires hi shy So I was trying to move the uh, wire with a stick and the wire came back and smacked me in the face and I touched the wire and nothing happened. So I think we're good. Now we're just opening windows because it's hotter than heck in here. Hotter than heck I tell ya. interest of public as well as for those people to give them a chance to live. So it's still closed at this time on power lines. Obviously you don't want to go around them, but you might want to let us know. My little childhood toy stayed on the mailbox. Your mom and dad know you're safe, right? Yeah. Grandpa's home is safe. Untouched. That's probably why. The storm surge looked like it was, it was uh, through maybe three to five in some areas. Oh, wow. It doesn't look like it did much damage to the house. No. Jesus. You can get a better picture when we come back. We just came from there? Yeah, there's a live power pole down across westbound lanes right now. It's still, still arcing. Uh, that must be the one by <laughs> the our power company just, just got yeah. through here, so they're going to kill the power, and then they got to get it down off the wire. It's like teetering back and forth. It's right in our street. It's right in our, our street. street. Yeah. So, okay. All right. Okay. So can we go, can I go, can any other way can I go through? Can, probably you can walk down there, possibly. We've you know? got you. We have a 90-year-old 90, 90 father left at home. Yeah. Yeah. I had to go um, check on his property. My father's That's right there. That's, that's Dad's, right. we just came out of there. Okay. So you can, you can, I can go across my street. Go, go, 
across your street. Okay. okay. East Bench can't go west. Okay. And you weren't out in the county. We had no county shut down. I know, I know you did. I know. Coming down Tampa Road, couldn't, they weren't allowed in. They yeah, we, we hung out until we got the all clear, and then we thought, okay, we'll be good to get home, but... Yeah, our lines are right down in our backyard. Yeah, with eight with eight Irish setters, I got to keep on... Keep, luckily, it's dead. The line's dead, so I can let them out. So, all right, thank you yeah, so much. Be safe. Take care. Thank you. That's like you sound right here. I forgot to inform you guys that my hospital went into lockdown before I could even make it there. So that's why I was home last night and able to help out. I'm so, so, so glad that I was. They've reopened and I'm gonna be working there for however long they need me, honestly. I just wanna help. I had a hotel booked for Disney for this Wednesday. Um, and I called about three or four days beforehand. I just wanted to give it up for Disney. They were amazing to work with, and they were just very understanding. So I just got out of work, and the power's back on for a lot of the city, so that's great. Um, I'm gonna go home. <sighs> it was a stressful night at work. Wow. Whew. People had been there for like 36 hours, like, three days some people it, w it was insane but I just busted my butt and worked as hard as I could to help everybody out I'm home. <laughs> She's losing it. Good morning, guys. Today is cleanup day. So this is probably the last day of the vlog just because one, there's not much to do left, and two, I'm running out of batteries and memory. So you can watch us cut down this entire freaking tree. We're already halfway done. And we just started about a half hour ago. We still have all of this to take down. We got one whole uh, branch down though. Playing right over there. Still got all this to do, but I'm having a good time with it. I'm the king. Oh my gosh, there's a cloud right now, and wind it is very nice. Got it. Woo! I need water. That is cool. 
guys, I need to show you something pretty amazing right now. We got a light! So I got sunburnt out there, uh, this is a couple days from then, I got everything edited and it's ready to upload and all I want to say is thank you guys so 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 much for sitting through like my little mini movie, I didn't realize that it was going to be that long, 45 minutes, wow. Thank you guys so much, we are all safe, I hope you guys are safe too if you're not and you need help or you just need, you, you, if you need anything, reach out to me because I'm here for you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Sorry for the background noise, I actually have a giant fan and a light going, and I can't turn off the fan because if I do, uh, it's just gonna get hot up here again because we're still running on generators and we're on day four of that. So, now I'm gonna go and I'm going to go and use a cellular hotspot and try and find some cell phone service in this area where everything is down. And it's about 11 o'clock right now. I have to wait for the video to render, which is gonna take about two hours. So at like 1 a.m., I'm gonna go and I'm gonna sit in a parking lot in my car and wait for this 45 to 50 minute vlog to upload. Thank you guys so much. For making it this far it means the absolute world to me well anyways guys my name is Brandon Gazrar I make brand new Disney videos every single Tuesday and Friday so make sure to subscribe right here and press that notification button to be notified when I upload brand new videos here's two videos that I picked out especially for you I know you're gonna love them and with that I leave you with peace love unity and respect thank you guys so much for watching bye guys Whoosh, choo.